It is like a billion degrees outside, so this stuff right here is a perfect fresh start to our morning. We're gonna need the energy. We're fueling up because we're gonna be making a, a long trip to Frankensons, and it's gonna be pretty fucking hot. It's about 100 degrees. So we'll see how this day plays out, but uh, breakfast was a good start. Sometimes you just gotta rise and shine with nectar. Uh, we're just gonna try to stay cool from here on out. There's no other stop we need to go to, right? Ross? What do you need for Ross? A little backpack, a tiny one. I don't know where my bag is at. I lost it. Just so I'm hearing this right, you misplaced your bag for a day and you want to go to Ross to buy a new one. Yes. I get it. I get it. We're traveling about 50 miles to get a couple of action figures when I already have thousands of them. Let's go to Ross then for a start of our day. Whenever I go to Ross's, I just, I never expect uh, to see any legends anymore. I always expect to see Fortnite figures, Roblox figures, no legends, bro. I haven't found a legend at a Ross in years. Whoa, hold on a minute. Look at this. Look at this. Okay, which one? This, this looks like something a grandma would wear. Um, I just like, I look at this pattern and I think of cigarette smell for some reason. Just uh, an old lady. I got this new bag, look at this. But this one right here, this is more of a, you know, washable material. Look at this one, this one's dope. Look at that material. That one's way better than both of them. Look at that. Nice. Look at that. You could put little pins right there on the blank space. Customize it a little, you know? Put some Bad Bunny pins on it. God damn! It's 111 out here, babe. It's a fucking heat storm out here. Woo! How you looking at that bag? Yeah! I picked out a good one. I picked out a good one. We'll see if we can find a couple of pins. God damn, I'm already out of breath. What are we gonna find? I don't know. One that I do have in mind is the Super Villains Marvel Legends Red Skull. Um, and I'm thinking a NECA Halloween 2 cloth Michael Myers. But we'll see what happens. God damn, it's hot! Oh my, Lana, we have AC in here. It feels good to be back. Let's hit the restroom real quick. We'll begin our hunt. Like I said, I don't know what I'm looking for in particular today. I'm just kind of hunting for the thrill of it. Whatever I find, I find, wow, look at these things. Bro, look at the whole Simpsons set they got going on here. Oh my gosh, this collection must be worth millions of dollars. I don't know, maybe not millions, but close, man. Like, it's impossible to find any of these. Look at this crusty down here, bro. Man. The whole family set. Okay, so first cop of the day, folks. We got water because it's hotter than shit. Mary's dying of thirst. Oh, that's cool. Look at that. All right, we're going to check out this NECA spot real quick. Um, oh, here he is right here. I want this guy right here on my shelf. I passed him up way too many times. Um, and this is a really accurate Michael Myers to me, especially from Halloween 2. So uh, how much is he though? She better not be like, oh, it's gonna be $50. It's okay, so she said 30 for the Myers, um, which is pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. I just gotta find uh, the best one that looks good with the face sculpt. I am very picky when it comes to that. Oh, check out this Jason right here too. Oh man, what a monster. Wow, man, I think this Jason's next on my list. <laughs> Finally, it got me my Myers. Halloween 2 is one of my favorite Michael Myers movies of all times. So now it's time to check out the portraits they have here. I love these. These are all so dope. Just the, just the right images, you know? Look at the Exorcist one. I don't even like Exorcist, but that looks badass. Got the Chucky, Jason, Freddy. Dude, the Mars Attacks Martian. 
it is so hard to find Mars attacks, like, you know, memorabilia. And that one is a killer. Looks good. Bunch of Stranger Things memorabilia. Looking good. They got every character. Fing, fing, foam for the 700 bucks. Oh, shit. Dude, Russian bears looking good too. I think I would want a Russian bear, honestly. I, now seeing him in person, he looks he looks really good. I like that one. Oh, that Godzilla 2000 looks so good. Guy gone. Oh man, I'm geeking out. I'm geeking out. Holy crap! Oh, I need to start a, a Godzilla shelf. I really do. But man, Godzilla figures are ridiculous with prices. They always have been. This Mecha Godzilla is a dream. I can never find a, a Mecha Godzilla without having to sell my soul. A oh, hundred bucks? You see what I mean? A hundred bucks for that beautiful masterpiece. Fuck! Check that out. It's my first time holding one of these new packaged Marvel Legends. And it feels weird, to be honest with you. It doesn't feel natural at all. I'm gonna miss that plastic, I tell you. Wow. Wow, man, those are killer. That looks really good. Got some loose legends here, folks. Very nice. Ooh, Captain Rogers, I like that one. A couple of Deadpools here. Looking good. Man, just seeing these guys out makes me want to pull my legends back out of storage. Ooh, okay, we got some new Joes here, folks. I haven't seen Baroness in her own package like that. Oh, this one looks so much better. Look, oh shit, they got out back. Stort for 55 bucks. They got Stort, folks. I'm not spending 55 bucks on a fucking store. I'm just not doing that. I've, I've been wanting him, but not for 55 bucks. All right. Ooh, Iron Spider-Man for 35. Man, I know I had a failed hunt with that Iron Spidey, but now that I'm here, I'm, I'm really not gonna make that my top priority. Like, there's other figures I'd want. If I found him in the wild at a Target, I would get him, but I, I'm okay for now. Like, it was a loss, but there's other... Oh my God. I love it. Let's go see what they have inside. Oh my gosh. Legends galore. Wow, this guy looks really good. I haven't seen him in person yet. Wow. Compound Hulk? Oh! Yo! Maestro looking good. <gasps> Super villains. They have Red Skull. Quicksilver looking good. I don't see... Speedball! Wow! I ended up getting Speedball uh, from a good friend Juanitos Monitos on Instagram for 20 bucks shipped, which I was very grateful for. Yeah, I'm not seeing a Red Skull though. Okay, we got some Joes here, folks. Destro. Still haven't gotten him yet. 25. Eh, I'm not in a rush to get him. Ooh. That's a must. That's a must, but not today. Not today, folks. 45, a little steep right now. I just spent 30 on a NECA figure. Damn. Why does Stuart have to be 55, bro? Oh, Reptile. So sick. Akuma. These Storm Collectibles are an arm and a leg, bro. Oh, wow. Mezco. Oh, Mezco Thanos. I'm still waiting. Will Mezco ever give us a Mars Attacks Martian figure? Just remake one for us, please, Mezco. I'm begging you. There's Myers right there. What you mean? <gasps> Bro, hold on. Why? Bro, why is this Red Skull $60? Nah, bro, this is why I never, I never like, oh, this guy's cool. Do they have a loose Zartan right there, but he's 25. No way, Jose. I'll do him for 15, but not 
Not 25, but he said this guy's 10 bucks. So I think he's pretty cool, but should I get him? Should I get him? Should I get him? I don't know. Ooh, here we go. Some more loose legends, guys. I'm being very careful with which legend I decided to take home. I, I decided to pass on him for 10 bucks. I'm just not, I'm just not in a rush. I'd rather put that $10 towards something I really want. Wow, that's how he looks outside the package. I'm kind of pissed now because he's very shiny and he looks really good. Look at this guy. Look at the Peter Parker and his homie he came out with. I love it. Let's go see what else he's got in there. He's, this guy usually has a, a good selection of G.I. Joes. But I love this. I love how you can just paint your own head sculpt, the custom head sculpt that they made. Especially the Cobra Commander, I really like that. I want a classic comic book Spider-Man to display on my shelf, but at this point, ooh, Tigra. At this point, it's really hard to find one without having to pay $75. Yeah, still no super villains red skull though. Look, babe. I'm looking for that red skull. You see him? Right there. These are pretty good. 18 bucks. Why is it the ones I want are always the most difficult? Oh, they got some Spider-Mans here. But negative on the red skull. <gasps> oh, there he is right there, that little fucker. I gotta tell you, for 30 bucks for the skull, I might have to grab him. That's a really good skull right there. I love the look of him. I love the suit, I love the head sculpt. Beautiful. To end my day here, I might just get the red skull and the Jason that I saw. Uh, to finish it off, these these fucking legends are getting crazy, man. There's like it's it's insane how you get two legends and you're already 60 bucks deep. So uh, we'll see. I might just get those two and call it a day. Gotta cop me a red skull, baby. Does it amaze you how much I spend on precious plastic? Yes. Uh, there's 40. So this is how this bastard looks in person. I've never seen him in person. He's pretty big, I'm not gonna lie, he's huge. Uh, do I still prefer my Marvel Legends Toy Biz reissued series Hulk? I sure do. All right, let's go get that Jason and let's go get some food, babe. What do you say, victory food, hey. Yeah, that's Mary's favorite part of our trips. What are we having for breakfast? What are we having for lunch? And what are we doing for dinner? So, uh, we'll find out after this. New blood, Jason. 30? Okay. So, I just, I can't pass this guy up. He looks so sick. You just, you see the meat all inside of his, his clothing. I love the look of the mask, the color. He comes with the alternative head and a broken mask that is broken in half. I love it, man. I, like, as a kid, I asked for this, uh, like a Jason from this movie. No one asked for the story, but okay. What's this nerd doing? Looking at the paint apps, you never know. You might find one that looks just a little bit better with the uh, the placement of the eyes, uh, the placement of the paint. <laughs> All right, I think I'll do this one. Thirty bucks. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I'm glad, I'm happy. I'm happy I didn't leave him behind. He's just, he just looks so good to me. Wait, let me see. What? What are you doing? Uh, oh no. Okay. <laughs> okay, so Mary picked her pin. Which one did you get? She got her a Michael Myers, hang on. She got herself a Michael Myers pin for her backpack. <laughs> what the fuck? We're taking one last look to see if we find any uh, Mars attacks. 
uh, type of figurines. This, this is the type of place that would have it. An army of Marvel Universe figures? That is just, wow. We don't have much, but they said it's like Okay, this was like from a different line. Yeah. Okay, and then that's the actual gun? I yeah. have those, we have those two. Dude, these are sick. One of these days, I feel like I will, uh, I'll land on one of those Martians. Um, maybe on eBay, but even on eBay, people, they charge them for, for quite a bit, so. I'm happy with what I got. I got a Jason. I got the red skull that I want to display with my Captain America. Um, I also got the NECA Halloween 2 Michael Myers, which I've been wanting for a while. Spooky season is coming up, so I'd like to start bringing out my Michael Myers figures, start decorating the, uh, the studio with some good old horror action figures. That was a pretty good trip though, right? It was calm. It wasn't crazy, hectic. A good hunt for the hunter, I'll tell you that much. We just need to pick a, a nice place to eat where we can sit down. And I can talk about figs. I can bring out my action figure, open it up on the on the dinner table, and you know have a bunch of people looking at us, especially the waiters or the waitress. All right, I'm gonna pick an expensive ass place. On second thought, we might want to leave the figures in the car. This Jeep has been sitting here in the heat. It's about to be hot as fuck. Oh. <laughs> Oh no! Woo! Woo! God damn! Hotter in the Jeep than it is outside. We're gonna finish watching um, for steam, right? Okay guys, so, so just to recap on the Jason, right? When spooky season starts, Mary and I like to start watching all the movies uh, quite early. Last night we watched Jason Goes to Hell, which was not too bad. Terrible. Mary's just, she doesn't like Jason for some reason. She says her his movies are boring, which I don't blame her. She's a Michael Myers fan, so I'd rather ha her, like I'm just appreciative that she's a Michael Myers fan, a Halloween fan, because those movies are actually entertaining. But I still love Jason for his intimidation. He's a big ass beefy dude with a machete and a hockey mask. And I just like his style, like he's, he's creative with his kills. He's very gruesome. But anyways, after we finished Jason Goes to Hell, I said, hey, you know what I haven't watched? That John Carpenter and Stephen King. Stephen. Is it Stephen King or Stephen King? I think it's Stephen. Stephen King. Both of them teamed up and directed a movie called Christine, which is about, I think, a possessed classic car that ends up killing a bunch of people. We didn't get to finish it last night. We fell asleep. So tonight we're going to finish the rest of Christine because that was a pretty good movie. Especially if it's a movie from John Carpenter. We were going to go to Buffalo Wild Wings um, but... It was raunchy in there. Just be honest with them. Don't even sugarcoat it. It was raunchy. It smelled like hookers and it smelled like beer. And as soon as we walked in, there was a pregnant lady and she just gave me the stink look. And I was like, I'm pregnant too. I can do that to you too. This is frustrating. Where is the foods? What is it? Buffang? Buffang? Dumpling? Yeah, it looks fire. I do like me some dumplings. Good. How did you like it, Mr. Red Skull? That was quite delicious! This is where I don't exist in life. We, on the way here, we saw a Halloween spirit down the road. Uh, we're gonna go check it out and uh, mess around with some masks, see if they got any new ones this year. I always like to clown on the Michael Myers masks they have, because they some of them look like doo-doo, man. Some of them, like, they just don't care about the paint or the hair. You gotta really rehaul most of these masks that you get from uh, from Spirit, uh, but you know we just love to to to, to have the vibe there um, with the Halloween spooky season and everything. So uh, let's go check it out. It is uh, early September, 
It is hotter than balls out here, and we're going to look at Halloween costumes. Let's check what they got. Gonna have a fucking seizure in here. That is fucking terrifying. would love this little guy this is adorable this is new this one's pretty dope the same with the michael myers look they got a little lamp uh. see it's way too glossy like these need work you know a nice little rehaul i do like this one though this one seems new hey, little guy you all right you okay huh Holy shit! Oh, you nasty bitch. Oh. This one. Oh. Whew. Not bad, not bad. Got a pretty decent stock. Some new things I haven't seen in the past couple years. I just want there to be a huge clearance at the end of the year so I can get a Jason mask. I can get that leather face mask. I like to dress up as different, you know, slashers, have a collection of the outfits too, in case I want to do like, you know, a, a skits or scenes to mess around with, you know? Um, but I, at least I got a Michael Myers one. I had a Jason mask, the movie hockey mask that someone sent me. And it got fucking stolen out of my storage unit. How depressing is that? But luckily they still have them around. I can always get it. Let's get the fuck out of here. Let's go home. Let's go home to where the AC is. I could pose my action figures. See you guys in a while so, uh, by the time we get home and uh, we'll say goodbye from there. All right, folks. So we're back in the studio. Um, just wanted to and the night showing you guys where I put my red skull. I uh, really love the way he looks with Captain America. Um, that's the whole reason I got him. I just wanted to pose him with my cap. Um, obviously, it would be even twice as better if Baron Zemo was unboxed and up there with him, which he might be very soon because I'm getting tired of looking at him on my wall. He looks so good over there, so tempting and I can't bring myself to do it, I just can't. And on this side, we have the Jason that I scored. Was really happy that I got this one. I mean, honestly, I just, I really was digging the look of the mask on this one. I just feel like the mask has a really good color to it. Uh, the camera doesn't do it justice. Like, you can see some good brushing on the mask. It looks a lot more realistic. Of course, you got the head swap there. Jason unmasked. Really stoked to have this one as a part of my collection. And lastly, we picked up the Halloween 2, Michael Myers from NECA. Again, Halloween 2 being one of my top favorite Michael Myers movies of all time. Um, next to 1978, of course, the first one that came out. I'm just really stoked to have that one. I really liked it because of the Halloween 2 mask. I feel like they did a good job of bringing the mask to life uh, as a figure. You can kind of see his eyeballs from here, which is creepy. Um, it just looks really good. Really love that one. So was today a successful trip to Frankenstein's? I would say so. I wasn't exactly going to hunt for anything particular, but just to have a good time and find some juicy figures that I've been wanting for quite some time. I just took the greatest ice cold shower known to man. I feel brand new. Today was a beater, man. We got our asses kicked with the heat, but we made it through. We went stop to stop, we went to a couple stores. We had a fun old fashioned Sunday. I got some figs along the way and it was just, it was a good day overall. With that being said folks, enjoy your figs, enjoy your families, and as always, I wish you a good hunting. Hell Hydra. Dun dun dun. Dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun.